Hey there, my name is Ian Dobson and I'm a musician. If you'll be attending one of my shows soon or just want to have fun making music with friends and family, then let me show you how to take the Recycalypso Challenge. You are going to invent your own original musical instrument using your creativity and resourcefulness. Recycalypso comes from a beautiful part of the world called the Caribbean. So to help explain what it's all about, let's go on a Caribbean cruise. Recycalypso! I'm here performing and teaching on board a cruise ship in the Caribbean. Right now we're just passing Cuba, which you can barely see in the mist behind us. This amazing instrument that I'm playing is called the steel drum or the steel pan. It's made from a recycled 55 gallon oil drum. Just think of an oil barrel. People in the Caribbean who didn't have access to musical instruments used their creativity to turn metal junk into beautiful music. Much of the music that musicians perform on the steel drum is in a style called Calypso. Recycling plus Calypso. Recycalypso! I know that you can be creative and resourceful just like the people from the Caribbean who created the steel drum. So are you ready to take the Recycalypso challenge? You are going to use your creativity and resourcefulness to invent your own original musical instrument. You're going to create your musical instrument out of recycled paper, cardboard, or plastic. Step one, look around your house or your school or wherever you use materials that get recycled. Step number two, experiment with different ways to make sound with all these wonderful materials. Oh, it's different on the side. What about this one if I put a rubber band over this? I could change the pitch. This one would be kind of cool. Like that. Let's see. Makes a different sound. What if I blow on it? Man, that makes a great flute. Wow. You can get those materials from the recycle bin or elsewhere and the only rules are no glass. We don't want any glass things, we'll put that back in the recycle bin. And also it's okay to bring small tin cans but make sure that they don't have anything sharp in them. This one is a little bit sharp here so I'm going to put that back in the recycle. This one is nice, no edges, it's nice and clean, it needs to be clean. Here's one example of an instrument that somebody made. They took a plastic bottle and they put some beads inside it and they decorated it with some glittery stuff and some nice uh, zebra tape on the top. Step number three is you want to start thinking about what to call your instrument. You're the inventor and you're the best player in the whole world because you invented the instrument. So you have to figure out what to call your instrument. So start thinking about that. This one is called Shake a Magoo and you play it like this. Now remember, you're the inventor so you can call it anything you want. You could call it something that has to do with what it's made of. Like this could be the egg carton thing that I play like this. Or you could call it something that has to do with the sound it makes. Like maybe this could be called the Or maybe you want to call it Frank or Sally. All right, now you're ready to show off your instrument and make some original music. Please follow the instructions below this video if you'd like to post your musical instrument on iandobson.com. We'd love to feature your creativity. And don't forget to bring your instrument or instruments along with you if you're coming to one of my shows. You'll be part of the band. I can't wait to see and hear what you've created.